before this video starts all right you know what i'm saying you want to put on these dunk animations all right so you want to go with tomahawks and put these two on go reverse put the put this on just trust me just buy the vc it's only like 750 vc each or maybe even cheaper but yeah you're gonna go elite and pro at least for two foot dunks go for one foot dunks get quick drop offs get athletic get reverse get for tomahawks and then get switcheroo as well as flashy hangs and elite contact dunks off two off one foot you don't need any of these so fuck that and then for you want to get for signature dunks mj as well as lebron these for the one foot dunks that also get contact dunks all right so what's up what's up youtube all right so in order to initiate those contact dunks all you're gonna want to do you feel me is know how to time your dunk meter all right so when you go in for a dunk hold, flick up and then hold down all right that uh, that's not how you do it but you want to flick up and then hold down right away with your right joystick if you're on playstation i'm not sure what it is on xbox so i don't want to like screw you guys over so you want to go flick it up and hold down and then time it just like that at first you're gonna feel like it's really un uncomfortable it's gonna go feel like you're going really fast but eventually you'll actually get it you feel me so this could be anywhere flick up and hold down just like so so yeah this could be anywhere and this is how you get contact on it's the best you could also hold square if you want but you're gonna actually have to like you know what i'm saying like these are not guaranteed you might get them just like 50 50 but in order to get an actual contact dunk you're gonna want to time your dunk meter so i recommend going to gatorade facility if you're on next gen or if you were in the my court on current gen flick up and hold down every time you're gonna screw up a couple times just like i did there but you can eventually get it you feel me this is guaranteed to get your contact dunk though so if you do get it then it's basically like a jump shot you feel me you just have to get on the green hold up and down just like that flick up and then hold it down and just hold it until you like until you feel me until you, it fills up same thing here it's like that screwed up there but you see where that green thing is it shouldn't be too hard as long as you're like practicing or whatever or like as long as you get used to it so yeah just like that if you get it perfect then you will get an excellent release so yeah it's basically just like a jump shot you could also use the comet meter i heard that one was like the best one but i only use this because my build could also shoot and i'm most comfortable with this one so yeah I'll flick up and hold down the more you get used to it the more you know what i'm saying like you're gonna feel more confident confident with it so yeah just like that but so right over here same thing you're gonna need stamina though i will say that when you go to do these contact dunks so it's much easier to actually time it so yeah all right so now you guys are actually gonna see proof that the dunk meter is actually you know what i'm saying like a very lethal option besides holding square in order to initiate contact dunks so i'm gonna show you guys clips of me using it in stage as well as park so yeah enjoy is going to be the end of the video you feel me i highly recommend you guys actually practice the dunk meter in the facility before going into a game so like you're really comfortable with it it is going to take you guys a minute before you get good but once you do you're basically unstoppable you know what i'm saying so yeah like comment subscribe and i'll see y'all in the next one peace